An electronic control unit AQ is any embedded system in automotive electronics that controls one or more of the electrical systems or subsystems in a vehicle. Types of AQ include electronic control unit, engine control module ECM, powertrain control module PCM, transmission control module TCM, brake control module BCM or EBCM, central control module CCM, central timing module CTM, general electronic module GEM, body control module BCM, suspension control module SCM control unit, or control module. Taken together, these systems are sometimes referred to as the car's computer technically there is no single computer but multiple ones, sometimes one assembly incorporates several of the individual control modules PCM is often both engine and transmission, some modern motor vehicles have up to 80 AQs. Embedded software in AQs continues to increase in line count, complexity, and sophistication. Managing the increasing complexity and number of AQs in a vehicle has become a key challenge for original equipment manufacturers OEMs. <laughs> Types. Door control unit DCU Engine control unit AQ Not to be confused with electronic control unit the generic term for all these devices Electric power steering control unit PSCU Generally this will be integrated into the EPS power pack Human machine interface HMI Powertrain control module PCM, sometimes the functions of the engine control unit and transmission control unit TCU are combined into a single unit called the powertrain control module. Seat control unit Speed control unit SCU. Telematic control unit TCU. Transmission control unit TCU Brake control module BCM, ABS or ESC Battery management system BMS Topic <laughs> Key elements Core Microcontroller Memory SRAM EEPROM Flash Inputs Supply voltage Digital inputs Analog inputs Outputs Relay drivers H-bridge drivers Injector drivers Logic outputs Communication links Housing Topic Design and Development The development of an AQ involves both hardware and software required to perform the functions expected from that particular module. Automotive ECUs are being developed following the V model. Recently the trend is to dedicate a significant amount of time and effort to develop safe modules by following standards like ISO 26262. It is rare that a module is developed fully from scratch. The design is generally iterative and improvements are made to both the hardware and software. The development of most ECUs are carried out by Tier 1 suppliers based on specifications provided by the OEM. Testing and validation As part of the development cycle, manufacturers perform detailed FMEAs and other failure analyses to catch failure modes that can lead to unsafe conditions or driver annoyance. 
extensive testing and validation activities are carried out as part of the production part approval process to gain confidence of the hardware and software. Onboard diagnostics or OBD help provide specific data related to which system or component failed or caused a failure during run time and help perform repairs. Topic. Tuning Some people may wish to modify their AQ so as to be able to add more functionality to it. Most ECUs these days however come equipped with protection locks which prevent users from modifying the AQ. The protection locks are made in a way that, when circumvented, triggers DMCA liability. This in effect makes modifying the AQ by circumventing the protection illegal except if done under an exception to the DMCA. G. Sanjay, 